Welcome to this demonstration of the Umbrella XS version of Underwriting Decision 1.0. This is a computer program that I developed to assist underwriters in consistently and effectively underwriting accounts and memorializing their thought process that they went through when they did their underwriting. The best way to do this demonstration is actually to walk through an underwriting process. In this case, I'm going to use a hypothetical manufacturer of gantry cranes used in ports to load and unload container ships. So let's get started. First, the underwriter will move to the general checklist and work through these tabs left to right. We'll capture the rateable exposure. Brief description. This next feature helps underwriters to uh, evaluate multiple named insureds. Now we're going to evaluate the reliability of the underwriting sources. You'll see based upon this information, the underwriting was relied on generally reliable information but an underwriter may want additional information. Do a quick review of management quality. Overall risk assess uh, assessment. Evaluate the premises operations. Life safety. We could be analyzing liquor liability if that was an exposure on this risk, but in this case it is not, so we'll click do not apply. Evaluate personal advertising injury. Move on to products exposures. Evaluate the product liability loss potential. Evaluate owned auto exposures. In this case, this risk has a couple um, private passenger cars and a couple pickup trucks.
evaluate non-owned auto exposures. And review potential employers' liability exposures for dual capacity claims and third party overactions. Moving to the next tab, this tells the underwriter if they've actually completed things correctly. In the first column, it corresponds to a question. In the right hand column, whether or not there are errors. If there was an error, it would show up here. In that case, the underwriter could click on the link. Go back, make the corrections, go back to review for more errors. There are no errors. On this tab, these, this is actually documentation based upon the, insure, the uh, underwriter selections. We'll scroll through this and it actually has used all the selections to write this up. As an underwriter, I always prefer to copy and paste this into a Word doc and do some additional customization before I cut it, copy it and cut it and paste into the uh, policy admin system that I was using. As you see, this has converted the documentation into text that can be modified and customized by an underwriter. I'm going to clean up some of the formatting that will give you a chance to read through some of the documentation that has been de developed. I'm going to add a bit of customization here. And the underwriter has now completed documentation for their underwriting thought process to drop into any uh, company's uh, policy admin system.